230 something points away from World Series, home team, so I'm pitching first with Otani, and we're facing a super fractor, John Donaldson. My first loss of the year was a game where my opponent started John Donaldson. Hopefully we do a little bit better this game. And this is on Hall of Fame difficulty. This is gonna be my first game on Hall of Fame this year. Everything else has been on All-Star or lower. I've not played on Hall of Fame difficulty this year and my perfect game and my no-hitter are gone that should be out number one Yelich gets there no problem a double play away from a scoreless top of the first and we strike out trout on a full count three and two toward Corey Seager runners going on the pitch and besides that little blue pit not a bad first inning for Shohei and then I strike out with babe okay we got to be a little bit more patient and Mike Trout breaks up the perfect game, breaks up the no-hitter. And that's ball four. Actually, it's a hit by pitch. It would have been ball four anyways to Palmero. Two on, two down for Mookie Betts. I would love a classic Mookie Betts home run right here. We had good timing, and I just didn't move the PC out of the ball. Following the leadoff single, we get a strikeout. And there's another strikeout. And that should be out number three. It's hanging up. Trout gets there. Another scoreless inning for Otani. And Yelich goes yard. Lefty, lefty. Perfect, perfect. Oh, that feels good. It's giving us our first lead on Hall of Fame difficulty. Lefty, lefty off of John Donaldson. I think he's super fractor too. I thought we... We did have another one. That's got to go. Yes. It's not a perfect, perfect, but that's a good swing. Two to zero, back to back home runs, both of them, lefty lefty. Speaking of home runs, I still don't have a single homer with Mike Piazza. He's up to parallel two, batting over 500, still no homers, and he's not going to have one after that swing. Why am I hitting best lefty lefty off of John Donaldson right now? This doesn't make sense to my brain. Maybe what I need is more lefties in my lineup. I'm pretty sure I had good timing, but the PCI all the way below the zone. And that's a strikeout to start the third. Mookie Betts grounds out to Freddie Freeman. And pitching on Hall of Fame has me just so much less stressed on the mound. Another strikeout for Otani. Let's go ahead and try to get him some more run support. And that's ball four to Trout. a leadoff walk for us here. And he hits Paul Merrow, I think, for the second time this game. He's not even standing close to the plate. I thought we had a homer with Mookie. 101 fastball, good timing. I moved the PCI in, but I didn't move it up. Yelich comes through. Lefty, lefty. It's not a great swing, but he came through. Oh, that's a double play ball, isn't it? Good swing. 97 off the bat. And after three, we're winning by three. Trout grounds out to start the fourth. And we strike him out anyways. And that's another strikeout. I thought we had it. I'm getting pitches to just destroy with Piazza, and I'm not doing anything with them. Freddie Freeman pops out. Good timing on 102. Move the PCI up, but not up enough. And Ronald just misses that. Okay, we've had some decent swings today, but after four, we're only winning by three. One pitch, one out to start the fifth. And he's bunting with Aaron Hicks and his 65 speed. I get that the shift is on, but I didn't even think he was going to beat that out. It's okay. And might not be... Oh my goodness, we're not even going to miss... Oh, we did. Okay. And Gary Sanchez makes it another scoreless inning for Otani. That's five of them. And Babe gets a leadoff single off of John Donaldson to start the fifth. No way. Oh, I was about to say, that's 100 off the bat. I really don't want that to be a double play. And Palmero just almost got hit a third time. It's a 3-2 count. I'm just going to send the runners on the pitch. Why not? And we got a double play avoided because I did not have the runners not stealing. Oh, that's ball four to Mookie Betts. My bad. I fell asleep for a second. We got bases loaded. One down. Christian Yelich coming up. He's two for two with the homer and a single. And Yelich comes through again. He's three for three. 
a home run, a single, and now a double. Just a triple away from the cycle, and we're only in inning number five. And Corey Seager gets another perfect perfect. I don't remember if his homer was a perfect perfect. I don't think it was, but he's going to be trading places. No, I think my, uh, I want to see my, so that's another homer for Corey Seager. And inside the park home run, he appears to be scared of the baseball, which the scoreboard does show as he's got zero runs, not too many hits, apparently is scared of the baseball. And Mike Piazza just got his first homer of the year. Let's go, Mike! And we're one run away from a mercy rule in my first Hall of Fame difficulty game of the year. And Freddy is going to get the inside the park homer for the mercy rule, it looks like. Yeah, so I guess my opponent has decided to give up. Uh, might be a good idea for him because it was already 9-0, 10-0, and our first Hall of Fame difficulty game gets called due to a mercy rule. We had a lot of good at-bats, a lot of good swings, even lefty-lefty, including Christian Yelich, 3-for-3, three three, homer, double, and a single, triple away from the cycle, Corey Seager with the home run, lefty-lefty, Mike Piazza got his first homer of the year. That's a pretty good first Hall of Fame difficulty game. And I'm up to 697, three points away from Division Series and 203 points away from World Series. Currently one win away from Division Series. And that means a season one vault pack. I actually didn't realize that, but 203 points away from World Series Division and only 12 points away from 100 points in the ranked program getting that World Series pack. One win away from Division Series, home team pitching first. And I think in my last four games, maybe even my last three games, this is my third time facing John Donaldson. One pitch, one ounce. Could you imagine a 27 pitch game on the mound? It's possible. That's two pitches, two ounce to start this game for us on the mound. And that is a three pitch inning for Oswalt. Okay, so we only have 24 pitches left and 24 ounce left in this game. And just like that, perfect game, no hitter gone for John Donaldson. And Babe strikes out. I think that was a full count. And Mike Trout lines out for out number two. Good swing. And it's a full count to Candelario with two outs. The runner will be going on the pitch. And it's ball four, bringing up Yelich. And we strike out. Shouldn't have chased that. And it's not a one pitch out in the second. It was 0-1 on Soto, but two pitches, one out for Roy Oswalt. And the very next pitch, we get out number two. And it's been a great start for Oswalt on the mound this game. Let's go try to get him some run support. Your opponent has requested a friendly quit. Brother, we're in the second inning. You have six outs on eight pitches. I had almost a lead after the first. Nah. And Mookie Betts is going to line out to start the second. Maybe I should have accepted that friendly quit. Oh, that's a nasty pitch. And we did not do anything in the bottom of the second. First pitch swing and to start the third is Austin Riley diving as Mookie Betts. And he's going to reach my perfect game, my no-hitter gone to start the third. Gary Sanchez, I thought it would be a double play ball. We got him on top of the sinker, but it's back-to-back -back singles to start the third. And Buxton hits it high, hits it deep. It'll be out number one. We have a full count to Mondesi. I'm just going to try to paint this corner with the fastball. Perfect release. Maybe a double play ball. Even with 99 speed, it's going to be tough. Or with 99 speed, it's going to be tough. But we got out of the inning. And that's ball four to Freddie Freeman. A leadoff walk in our half of the third. I thought he was going to be two for two. Only 85. Oh, wait. It's gone. I was going to say only 85 power. It's a great swing. And it's a great feeling on a two-run home run. Number 20 on the year for Ronald. I'm loving his live series card. And Babe follows it with a perfect, perfect home run. Average going to be up above 420. He smoked that one out of here. Eight homers on the year. 25 RBIs on the year. And my opponent appears to have quit before it landed. So actually, that home run is probably not going to end up counting. Yeah, lost connection with opponents. So Babe still stuck at seven homers, still stuck at a 419 average. But 
we are above 700 for the first time this year. That means no matter what, my next ranked game will be on Hall of Fame difficulty. We started the year with an 11 game win streak. We're currently on a three game win streak. Let's try to get closer to World Series. Hall of Fame difficulty, home team pitching first. It's Pedro Martinez versus Randy Johnson. That's a good start. Three pitches, one strikeout for Pedro. And then Mondesi grounds out for out number two. And then Adam Dunn. I thought he might have hit a home run, but it's a perfect top of the first for Pedro Martinez. Now on Hall of Fame difficulty. My first Hall of Fame game was versus John Donaldson. My second is versus Randy Johnson. Let's see how this goes. And we strike out with our first batter. And that's ball four to Babe. So we have the perfect game gone from Randy Johnson. Let's try to focus on breaking up that no hitter. Mike Trout's coming into this game with a 520 batting average for me on the year. And Trout, I'm going to send the runner. You know what? I don't think this is going to be caught. And that's going to be a double play. After one, we are tied at zero. J.D. Davis flies out to start the second. Striking out Justin Turner for round number two. And then we strike out Jose Abreu. Two perfect innings for Pedro. Ball four, runner take your base. Ooh, we just struck him out to start the third. Another strikeout. Yo, Pedro's kind of dealing. Oh, no. And then besides the hit, not a bad inning for Pedro. Three scoreless innings. Man, we've had some good swings off of Randy. It's on Hall of Fame difficulty. A perfect out to end the second. That out to start the third. That's a tough feeling. And that's going to be out number two. Dang it, man. We swung at a strike. I'm glad we didn't chase ball four. And Trout is going to hit it hard, but playable by the left fielder. Some good swings for us today. Not a lot of hits so far for us today. Jammed is Mondesi. And that's going to drop? That's a big strikeout, though, of Adam Dunn. A double play away from another scoreless inning. And we strike out J.D. Davis. Huge. Back-to-back -back punch outs. Pedro is sweating up a storm. And we struck out the side after giving up a leadoff single. Four scoreless for Pedro. And we got the win. Okay, 2 nothing after four. Not even getting four innings of at-bats. And we're up to 752. Only 148 points away below 150 from making World Series. Win streak stays alive. Getting closer to World Series. Less than 150 points away. If y'all enjoyed, feel free to drop a like. Subscribe for daily uploads. And I will see y'all next time. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a great rest of your day.